All right. All right. Hey, everybody. This is Ryan here with Anime Pad. And we are here at Anime NYC 2019 with the actual Crunchyroll booth. The entire section is more than a booth. They got a whole playground. But we are here, and I'm here with... Lauren Stevens. I'm the events manager over at Crunchyroll. And I'm gonna, I might steal Crunchyroll Playground from you later. Yes, yes. That's the new thing. That's the new thing. But talk to me. Uh, Dr. Stone is very huge here. We're really pushing. You guys are really pushing Dr. Stone as one of your titles. Yeah, we, we really love the opportunity to get to work with Dr. Stone. Uh, we did a huge push down at Anime Expo. We were able to premiere down there. Uh, you know, really start getting the show out to fans. I really love uh, my Shonen shows, so I'm a huge Dr. Stone fan right now. I'm only behind by one episode, and that's because I'm here and I'm working. So, uh, otherwise, uh, the show's great. We're really excited to, you know, show it off to fans, really get it out there, and really give them a chance to engage with one of the shows that they love. Nice, nice. And, and if you don't know, Dr. Stone, uh, they actually brought uh, Boichi-san here, and he is here. He did a live a really great live drawing and the panel was great but just uh talk about the popularity of dr stone right now uh definitely fans are loving dr stone uh so much so that you know we're really excited we brought out a dr stone mosaic wall for fans to engage with so you get to take a photo with the sort of the background of the stone world it has an overlay so you get to see Duke. i'm a huge fan of the rising of the shield hero uh, yes, you, yes. I'm not sure if you read our industry panel yesterday, but we did announce a partnership with What's Your Passion Jewelry, uh, where they will be bringing the Rising of the Shield Hero jewelry collection out soon. Wow. So, very happy to be working with some of our strong fan-engaged titles, you know, things we love, things our fans love, really getting a whole different experience. So for Shield Hero, our fans have had the opportunity to get bags, they've had the opportunity to actually do our Shield Hero training room where you get a chance to experience what it's like to be now Fumi at level one. You get a shield and you have 15 seconds to pop 10 balloon monsters using only your shield and your body. It is real hard to be a level one shield hero, but our fans are loving it. Awesome, awesome. And can you speak to uh, your Crunchyroll games actually? Uh, I can speak a little bit to games. I don't work on it a lot. Uh, we do have a games division. Uh, they're putting out really cool titles like Naruto Boruto Ninja Tribes, which is coming soon. Bob Psycho 100 Psychic Battles is also coming soon. And then we've partnered with DNA and we have Attack on Titan Tactics is out, Ruby Crystal Match, and oh gosh, there's one more at that booth. Sorry, I know my booth real well. I'm blanking out too. Hold on, hold on. I can do this. It's not Bob. It's not Titan. It's not Ruby. Kill a kill? Uh, Grand Summoners. There we go. Okay. So it's Grand Summoners, and they have a Kill a Kill um, special event going on right now. They did it previously, but it was so popular, they decided to do another one. Nice, nice. We actually have uh, our very own mascot, Crunchyroll Hime, is in Grand Summoners now. She's a playable character. We did a special for a while with them, so some people were able to snag her. I hear she's a little OP, <laughs> but nothing wrong with that. And I usually have my uh, Hime glow-in-the-dark shirt that I got from Crunch Roll 2017. Yeah, there's quite a few Hime shirts out there now. Unfortunately, I didn't wear it today, but... That's all right, man. I, <laughs> I just... It's a show and it's cold. <laughs> I, I love to say that Crunchyroll is our home uh, at Anime Pad. Oh, thank you. Yeah. We're, we're flattered. We really want to be a place where fans can feel like not only are they welcomed and appreciated, but that they are home. That, you know, we want to be everything to our fans. We don't want to be everything to everyone. Just we want to be everything to to we want to be all important to our fans. So trying our best. <laughs> and is there any juice, any exclusive you can give me? Uh, were you on our industry panel? I was not. Okay, so at the industry panel, we were able to show some cast videos um, just for Anime NYC from Woodpecker's Detectives Office. Yes. Uh, we did hype up that we had our uh, Destructive God sits next to me and Somali and the Forest Spirit uh, screenings last night. Uh, we actually were able to show a new key art and a new PV for Somali and the Forest Spirit. Uh, I didn't actually get to go to the panel. Very sad uh, because Somali is one of the shows I'm looking forward to in the winter season. Uh, if you haven't seen what that show's about, it's about a five-year-old girl who, um, in a world where humans are becoming extinct, she decides that a forest golem is going to be her father and she wants to live the rest of her life with him, but he has a very limited lifespan and will die within a little over a year. 
Um, so you're following sort of their journey in that world and his bond with this, this, this little girl. Uh, so I feel like it's giving me a lot of, uh, for my daughter I would even defeat a demon lord vibes. Okay. But with this, it's, it's very beautiful, it's art like Mushishi. Uh, but it also has this sort of melancholy undertone because of the, the finite lifespan. Now, just just to wrap, any last word We love Country Roll. Like, give me. I know you love Country Roll too. So. I do. <laughs> I, I love Country Roll. I love working here. And I got to tell you, we at the end of the day, we all we do it all for the fans. Like, you guys are what keeps us going. You know, we wouldn't be able to bring you fun things like the Doctor Stone Mosaic activation or the Shield Hero training room or a chance to be, you know, take a photo with the Straw Hat Pirates over at One Piece. We wouldn't be able to do those things if you guys weren't so passionate about the shows that we're putting out there. So at the end of the day, we're doing it all for you and we really appreciate, you know, everything, everything you guys say, everything, you know, all the feedback, all the positivity, all the love. That's really what keeps us going. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We are out with Crunchyroll. So you got your banana bag? Yes, I do. I do. I, I have it. If you are here at Anime Agency, check it out. The playground is awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Thank you.